guys welcome back or welcome to my channel my name is Paola today I'm filming a requested video on my David Yurman bracelet collection this video was requested by a lovely subscriber of mine so thank you so much for requesting this video I do apologize if you can hear the air vent it's like right over my head and I can't film in the living room today because it's just it's a mess so <laughs> I'm having to film in this room today so we're gonna work with what we have grab yourself some coffee and let's just get right into this video if i am looking down i'm looking at my laptop so that way i can give you the right information on my bracelets because i don't know this information off the top of my head so here are the three bracelets that i have from david yearman i will show you each one individually so let's talk a little bit about the packaging so here's the box that the bracelets come in and it says David Yearman. So when you open this, you open the flap up. So this is what it looks like. Very, very pretty packaging. I love it. This is my oldest one. This is the first one that I got. This is what introduced me to David Yearman. I think I got this five, maybe six years ago now. So it's been a while. So this is the Cable Classic bracelet with 14 karat yellow gold. And you see the gold detail at the end. And this is in the five millimeter. And I do have really small wrist. I will have my wrist size in the description box. I forgot to measure it before this video. So I have a tiny, tiny wrist. So it's very difficult for me to find bracelets and rings that fit just right most of the time i have to take them in to get resized so if you have small wrists like i do i think these bracelets are going to work perfect for you so here is the classic cable bracelet in the five millimeters the next two that i'm about to show you i got these i think a year ago a year and a half ago but these two are my newest pieces to my collection so i'm going to start off with the buckle bracelet with 18 karat yellow gold and it has a buckle clasp closure so you close it by pinching both ends and then you open it by pinching both ends again this one is in the four millimeter this one does not adjust to my wrist so this one is a little bit loose on my wrist all right so the last one is the x station bracelet with 18 karat yellow gold so on the x that's where we have the yellow gold detail and this one is in the four millimeter I wear these all the time. These are by far my favorite bracelets that I own. It would be very hard for me to pick just one, but if I had to pick one from the three that I have, I think I would pick the classic cable. Maybe because it was my first piece, but I think this is just, I don't know, you can't go wrong with this piece. There is a way that I wear these every time I wear them. So the cable classic is the first one that I put on. And then I will wear the buckle bracelet because this does not adjust to my wrist. That's why I have it there in the middle. The last one is the X station bracelet. And this is how I wear them every time that I use them. Love, love, love. And I would love to add at least two more to my collection. I think they're just perfect everyday bracelets. I have a video where I do outfits of the day. If you want to kind of get an idea of what I wear and how I style the bracelets, then you can watch that video. I will have it linked down below. Um, I just love them. I think they're perfect. And for the amount of time that I've had them, especially this one, which I had the longest, they've held up great. I don't see any, like, I don't see any scratches, not much wear on them. I will have to say is that they will tarnish if you stop using them for a while. When I first had Cami, I wasn't wearing any jewelry, so I didn't wear these for about two months. And when I went back to wear them, they were very tarnished. So I did have to clean them with a polishing cloth which you can get them at David Yearman. I'm pretty sure they'll give you these if you ask for them. So I did have to clean them when I stopped using them. So they will tarnish if you don't use them. If you use them, I, I don't really see any tarnishing. Like I haven't cleaned them in I think over a month now. And this is how they look. 
So yeah, that would be the only con with the bracelets, but and that's not a deal breaker for me. I still love them and I wear them as often as I possibly can. So I really hope this video can help you out if you're looking at starting your David Yurman bracelet collection or if you're wanting to add more to it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.